poultry growth. It's the C87 in Red Hat that makes a difference. Thousands of successful poultry growers have found that remarkable C87 in Red Hat starting mash offers many advantages, including faster growth, greater livability, greater uniformity of development. Neighbors, get Red Hat starting mash. Lower feeding costs, increased profits. See your Red Hat dealer today. 12.15's the time. Let's have us a big Suncrest orange. What you say? An anytime refresher. Try Suncrest. Delicious orange flavor. That's Suncrest. There's an awful lot of pleasure. And you get full measure in an ice cold bottle of Suncrest. Have that Suncrest orange now, neighbors. Let's get things started because we got music by the Watkins Brothers, Curly Fagan, and all the red hat young uns. <laughs> Man, I got it all out then. Tell us how y'all feeling. It's right, real pretty, pretty Wednesday afternoon. Well, I'm feeling kind of pretty myself. You know, I don't look it now, but I feel pretty. <laughs> we got well. Th thank you, boy. Thank you. Thank you. I don't know why I ought to. I mean, just as ugly as usual. But well, we got the three of the prettiest boys in Alabama going to sing for you neighbors during this 15 minutes. The Watkins Brothers trio. And uh, we got the fourth one. Uh, bless his heart, he can't help it because he ain't quite so pretty. He's a little older, Curly yeah. Faye again. Got pretty co curly hair. He's got pretty coily hair going all down in his eyes. Yeah. 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 Curly, am I embarrassing you, son? That's, no, that's all right. That's all right. That's all right. He's turning three colors, ain't it? <laughs> curly, grab that fiddle, son, and let's go like a Mississippi Sawyer. We remember we, we promised the folks this yesterday on our tape recorded program. Day four yesterday. Yeah. A one, a two, a three. Mississippi Sawyer. <laughs> Nice to have all these folks business in here with us in our studio. And Howard, we kind of appreciate you holding down the control board in that too. That ball, hold it down now. Sit down on it, Howard. That'll be a little bit better. <laughs> that, this is that boy's off day today, fellas, and you, you you just can't get him away from around here. He likes to likes to kind of stick around and help the production product just just a little bit better. He is the best producer you ever seen in your life, man. The only thing is he can't make no hair grow up on his head. Curly even got him a 25-pound uh, sack of Red Hat start mash, and it just wouldn't do no good. And, and then he got the Red Hat growing mash, and that wouldn't do no good. You might as well. Gonna start growing now. Though. Yeah, you're going to start putting laying mash up there, yeah. Curly. <laughs> 18 and oh, Howard, we just kidding with you now, son. 18 and a half minutes now, neighbors, afternoon. You know, Mother, you just don't know, honey, how good a corn muffin can be until you've eaten one of them made with Mother's Best corn meal. It's going to have a rich, full, fresh corn taste and the result, neighbors, of a special cleaning process used by Mother's Best. Carefully selected corn is washed, the neighbors, first with water, then with air, and it's cleaned two times to bring you a corn meal with true whole corn flavor. That's why your corn meal recipes turn out so rich in full-bodied corn goodness when you make them with Mother's Best corn meal. Go Golden tender hush puppies and warm oven fresh cornbread with feather like texture. Delicate corn sticks so good at snack time. Why, neighbors, you, why don't you try one of these favorite cornmeal dishes yourself today? It's easy when you use Mother's Best cornmeal because the salt and the bacon powder has already been added to save you time and work in the kitchen. And you can depend on the same perfect results every time because the self rising ingredients are blended in with scientific skill and accuracy. And neighbors, don't forget now the extra nourishment you get with Mother's best corn meal. If it's mother's best neighbors, you know it is the best. Let the house gal around her biscuit bar, the best in town, the Texas house is all red and thick with mother's man. <laughs> we sure 
sure proud to have Alma's love lady and one of the Walden Trio gals here with us today. All these nice neighbors out here visiting with us on this reel. And Alma, now you sit down and handle yourself back here now. So behave yourself. <laughs> 20 minutes now, neighbors, past 12 o'clock. Fellas, it's good to feel good, ain't it? Man, I'm telling you, I feel gooder than gooder today, too. Hey, Bud Wright, we want to thank you for sending that right nice request in here to the Watkins Brothers in Gadsden, Alabama. Mrs. W.B. Goble. Is any kin to George Goble, by the way, boys? I ain't wondering about that. This is from Anniston, Alabama. Wants the song for Mama and Papa, Mr. and Mrs. Walter Williams of Thermal, Alabama. We just appreciate hearing from you so much. And neighbors, don't forget to be with the Watkins Brothers, Curly Fagan, and all the Red Hat Kids at 55 Bob Arnold Ford Station Wagon. We'll be heading up toward Millport, Alabama this Saturday afternoon, neighbors, at 2 o'clock. This is going to be you neighbors' last chance now to meet with the Watkins Brothers in person, so come on out and be with the fellas at 2 p.m. at Cole Brothers, Millport, Alabama, this coming Saturday afternoon at 2 o'clock. Yeah. And we'll tell you where the boys will be a gallivanting off to Saturday night right after we have us a real pretty, pretty gospel song. We got a good one today. Fellas, I think y'all used this one day last week. And it, you did such a good job. And we had so many nice, nice cards and letters commenting. For all of our sick and shut-in, we're going to let Big Brother Richard and Bobby and Jimmy sing There's a Beautiful Home. <laughs> For you and for me And the beautiful home So wonderfully fair And the Savior for me Has gone to prepare There's a beautiful home Far over the sea There's a beautiful home For you and for me like that kind of good old-time singing. That's good. Well, y'all gonna have to get that on maybe Friday again now, really, because that is our pretty song. Play that for all of our sick and shut-ins. By the way, Curly, I have been caught with my weather forecast down. It's sitting on the control board. While I talk about Mother's Best, will you tiptoe in the other studio and get it for me? Mama, you want a nice surprise, honey? You try using Mother's Best flour next time you do some baking. I'm telling you, you'll be plumb amazed at the wonderful difference it makes in your cakes and your pies and your biscuits and all of the good things you bake. First, neighbors, you'll feel the difference in the mixing bowl because Mother's Best flour blends smoothly and quickly, makes your dough a batter easy to handle. You'll see the difference, too, neighbors. Dough highs, uh, rises higher and lighter, and that fine, even texture that cooks are so proud of you'll have. Best of all, your baking is going to taste better, different, have a fuller, richer flavor. What's the reason of this big difference, neighbors? Well, the Alabama flour mills have found the perfect combination of several wheats, and they've blended them skillfully into one perfect flour. This careful combination of different wheats is the only way to get a flour that has all the quality the woman wants when she bakes. Flavor, ease of handling, and dependability. And the new Mother's Best is the only flour that gives you this exact right combination. Come on, Mother, discover the difference in Mother's Best flour for yourself. You'll be surprised and amazed at the wonderful difference it'll make in all of your baking. 
And boy, they wish y'all could have been over to our house last night. Man, we had Mother's Best Biscuits made, made buttermilk style, boy. Oh, and we had that good old country grease just oozing out the side of it. I tell you, that sweetie pie Angie of mine sure knows how to make Mother's Best Biscuits. Of course, they're half made when you get started, neighbors, because you use Mother's Best Flour, see. Mother's Best is a flour that outbakes, outtastes all others, or you get your money back. So come on, honey, and get Mother's Best Flour today. And by the way, you folks around Bessemer, be sure to buy a little extra Mother's Best Flour and self-rising cornmeal this weekend. Berlin Starn says they got a great big sale going on, and if somebody out there happens to see Berlin between now and tomorrow, please have him call me and tell me uh, who this money is going for. I think it's the PTA, but I ain't sure. It slipped my memory since he told me last Thursday, nearly a week ago, and I'm getting, my memory's getting shorter and shorter every day, boy. So, neighbors, you buy extra Mother's Best this weekend. Curly, ask me something, huh? Well, what's the weather going to do? I'll hand it to you, and you tell the folks what the weather's going to do. I'll surprise you. You go right ahead. Just tell them what it's going to do for Birmingham. It's fire and mild this afternoon. <laughs> and uh, clear and not quite so cold with frost tonight. <laughs> it's going to be frost, It's going to be frost, Curly. Got frost up here, son. Uh -huh. Thursday, partly cloudy and warm high. Today, 63. Uh -huh. Low tonight, 33. Yeah. High tomorrow, 69. What is it right now, Curtis? Present is 59. Humanity, 23. He got it, boy! That was a dirty trick to hand that back to him and make him give the forecast, wasn't it? it caught him off guard, boy. I, I got him off base that time. I'm glad I found out it was going to frost, though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you find out it's going to frost again in the morning, didn't you? And, of course, I, I had the Alabama forecast on a while ago. Same thing, partly cloudy and warmer this afternoon tonight. And Thursday going to be a little cool again in the morning. Folks, don't forget now, this coming Saturday night is the big night for the Watkins brothers, Curly Fagan, and all the Red Hat kids. And a Bob Arnold Ford station wagon just loaded down with prizes and surprises. Got 300 jars of Golden Eagle soft and surf in there. 50 pounds each of Mother's Best Flour, self-rising cornmeal, red hat feed, and a great big show at the Brookwood High School. And I hope Mrs. Pate and Mrs. Abstin feel better. Now, I've been calling it the junior high, but it ain't the junior high. It's elevated. It's, it's the Brookwood High School at Brookwood, Alabama. This Saturday night, neighbors, April the 2nd, the day after April Fool's Day. So y'all come out and have a good time with the boys. Hey, fellas, let's kind of slip in about a couple of verses of this little Tennessee border song. This is a song that our good buddy boy Jimmy Work wrote about eight or nine years ago. Bobby, sing Tennessee border. I met her in my little Bob Arnold Ford on the Tennessee border. Her eyes were blue, her hair was all blue, and her smile was like an angel do. I fell in love the night I saw her. Border. One night I took a ride just across the line. I picked her up in a pickup truck and she broke this heart of mine. Well, her mother said no, she's my only daughter. But we got married on the Tennessee border. One night I took a ride just across the line And I picked her up in a pickup truck and she broke this heart of mine Well, her mother said no, she's my only daughter But we got married on a Tennessee border Bobby, right nice there. Well, neighbors, that about does it today. If you'd like to come around and visit the Watkins Brothers and Curly Fagan here in the studio tomorrow, maybe Friday, come on out and be with the boys in person every day from 12.15 until 12.30. Well, we've enjoyed ourselves, neighbors, and we hope you have too. Don't forget Mother's Best Flour and Self-Rising Cornmeal. Mighty, mighty good eating. Boys, it's team tong time. We gotta go, you know? We gotta go! Oh. Let's get out of here! Let the howl that gal around. The biscuits are the best in town. The kicks and the pies and all the rest. Fix them all with Mother's Fair! Good music, neighbors, by the Watkins Brothers, Curly Fagan, and all the Red Hat Kids for the Alabama Flour Mill of Decatur. Join us again tomorrow, folks, at 12.15. Stay tuned now for little Jimmy Dickens, and I'll see you this afternoon from 3.15 until 4.30 on Afternoon Jamboree. Remember, neighbors, you bake your best when you bake it out of Mother's Best. So long, fellas! So long, Johnny! So long, Joe! Goodbye, boys! WVOK, Birmingham.